Jay Lock here. I'm going to walk you through my basic setup on getting Rift running in IS Boxer and Interspace. Uh, first thing you want to do is go ahead and load your game. There's a couple settings that you need to change. Um, basically, in the video, you want to make sure that you're in windowed mode. And I, it, I've had it work on both, but I switched it over to full screen windowed just to get rid of the outside bar, kind of like what Interspace does on its own. After that, we'll quit out and we'll jump into setting up Interspace and IS Boxer. Okay, to get Interspace set up, first thing that we need to do is right click on Interspace and go into Patcher. And I want to make sure that you click on Download Development Test Patches until it to patch the files. You'll probably need to close out of Interspace and reopen it for it to take effect and download those files. Once that's done, we need to add a new game. So we'll right click on the inner space icon down by the clock, go to add game. We'll name this one Rift. For me it's going to be Rift 2. Go into your game executable path. It's going to be wherever Rift's installed. And you want to tell it to load the Rift patch beta. Once that's done, we need to go down to the inner space icon again and go to configuration. In the game configuration, let me switch over to a new one. We'll need to go into the default profile, just make sure everything's right there. Um, if you want to use two profiles, one thing that I've run into, the way Rift patches its game is every time it runs it patches the configuration file. And so if you're trying to run out of two folders to get different graphics configuration on each one, it won't work because both those, no matter where the game's installed, they both run off the same configuration file. If you change it, Rift basically patches it right before it loads the game. And so you can't really get around having two different graphics config files at the moment until they fix that. So we're just going to leave it as the single profile right now. Apply it. And then we'll jump into IS Boxer and get set up. Starting from a new one, we can go through the wizard. Um, the game's not listed in here yet, so it's going to be other. And tell it that we want to use the game that we just created for the profile. Use the default profile. Next. How many of our characters you're using, you want to just add them here. I'm just going to be using two instances right now. This will be your character set. And then your window layout. I'm using two monitors, so I'm going to switch this over. Um, <coughs> basically, I like having my full screen on my first monitor and then small windows on my second. Um, we can do the default keys. I need to change a couple of them around, but that should be fine. Okay, so in here, a couple things that we need to do. Character should be set up right. Your character set. Uh, I like to put hotkeys in for switching between characters. Key maps are also up. Okay, so key maps, a couple of them that I've had problems with. Your next window and previous window, right now I can't get this one to work. Um, I think Blacks is working on fixing this now, but I'll set my hotkeys for him anyway. That's one in there. Um, later on, I'll, I'll create like a follow macro and stuff like that. I'll show you how I do it in game and everything. So that's fine there. Under Windows layout for mine, since I'm using two monitors, I like to set this so that region two gets used for my first slot. 
So whichever one I have active is on the main screen, then first is there, basically it opens up a slot for each thing. Um, one thing I did run into is if you try to manually change the dimensions in this, it really messes up the way the game looks. So you want your main screen to be at the same size as what you have set in game. These don't matter, but when it goes into your main region, you want to make sure that it matches whatever resolution you have set in game. That should be all that we need to set that up for. I'm going to save my IS Boxer profile. Just call this one test. And we need to export to Interspace. <coughs> From there, you can right click on your Interspace icon down by your clock, go to your IS Boxer character sets, and load up the one that we just created. Pop open the patcher, your first instance, log in, hit play, wait for it to do its thing, and assuming everything works, it should pop up in its own window over on my second screen. switching over here and escaping so I don't have to watch that video. should be all you need to do to set it up to get it to run. Next video we'll go through some hotkeys, how to set it up. Uh, just very simple, you know, commands to go through for both parties. Nothing, nothing too outrageous right now. But we'll get that one set up soon. Thanks.